Merry Christmas, dosto. Welcome. Christmas tree, Christmas mood, and me dressed up as Santa. Welcome to a fun-filled Zoom review show. I am Omar Qureshi, your filmy friend, and I am here to bring you movies and their magic this holiday season. Which film will be released and which will be released? I will tell you. But first, pick up your phones and SMS me on 5888 your views on the film's YouTube channel. Let's start. 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 Let's We will air your comment live during the show. The first decade of the new millennium is coming to a close and first up is Farah Khan, India's purest Bollywood masala director who's back with the latest offering, Tees Mar Khan. This time minus Shah Rukh Khan. Tees Mar Khan ek high profile chor ki kahani hai played by Akshay Kumar. But will this chor be able to steal any hearts this Christmas? Aur jab Christmas ki baat ho rahi hai to Bollywood has something for the children as well. Toonpur ka superhero comes to the cinemas this weekend. It is India's first live action come 3D animation film. And Hollywood encourages you to travel to the theaters this week with the tourist. Getting on with our first film, Tees Mar Khan reunites the hit jodi of Akshay Kumar and Katrina Kaif aur ye film director Farah Khan ki third release hai. Let's see if she's going to be third time lucky. There are ageless stories about the probable Tees Mar Khan in Indian folklore and Farah brings his character alive in a film. From his mother's womb Khan had an overdose of crime movies that mommy loved to watch. So he learned the tricks of the trade literally from the womb and grows into the uncatchable con artist thief. But semi Robin Hood, one who robs from the rich and gives very little back to the poor. The gang comprising of dollar, soda and burger keep applauding his abusive lines and his corny dialogues and still manage to keep the Indian police as well as Interpol on their toes. Then a pair of Siamese twins called Jory Brothers who are international antique smugglers assign Tees Mar Khan the biggest con job of his life he must rob antiques worth 500 crore rupees from a heavily guarded moving train will khan and his merry gang with some unwitting support from the wannabe actress girlfriend anya and an oscar greedy bollywood superstar be able to pull off the greatest heist in history while shooting a make believe film watch the action Not only is Akshay Kumar the star of Tees Mar Khan, he is also the producer. No wonder that he puts everything he has into this project. It's a role he does best. A comic cool character outlandishly dressed and spouting corny one-liners. Akshay looks good, acts cool and is a right madcap character for Tees Mar Khan. He goes over the top at times but such is the nature of the role. Akshay is superb as the cool thief on the outside with the MCP husband at heart. TMK could see the spawn of a hotshot style zany and insane comedy sequels with Akshay playing Tees Mar Khan each time. Akshay is the backbone of the film, effortless as he is on top of the lungs screaming and quick paced comedies and he does very well. Katrina plays Anya Khan, Tees Mar Khan's wannabe actress wife who spoofs the quintessential 80s heroines who dab on tons of makeup and act in high pitched over dramatic tones. This is Katrina's umpteenth pairing with Akshay and the two display a sparkling chemistry. Her comic bedroom scene with Akshay is very cool. Katrina isn't around as much as we'd like her to be in TMK, but just one number makes up for the vitamin cats deficiency in the film. Sheila ki jawani. Katrina makes the screen come on fire with her ode to Madhuri Dixit's Dug Dug and draped in white blanket Raja act. The actress has come a long way and shows why she's at the top of the heap. She looks great too. Katrina rocks it. Moving on to Akshay Khanna, in one word, he is brilliant. As Atish Kapoor, the superstar with dreams of Hollywood and a craving for an Oscar, Akshay does a brilliant Anil Kapoor takeoff and is simply fabulous. As the actor who rejected Danny Boyle's slum dog because his secretary mistook Danny's call to be that of Danny Dinzong Pass, this actor is sensational, especially in his Kranti Kari act scenes. He is a highlight. Farah shows once again why she is among the most intelligent directors ever in Bollywood. She knows the insides of Bollywood. Once again there are the smart one liners, the inside cracks of the stars this time at SRK2 and the whole comic book racy pacey masala style of filmmaking. The first half she's at her best but the second half is all over here and there and there are too many characters crowding the landscape. But Farah's storytelling holds its own. This may not be as intelligent as her Mehuna or OSO but then it wasn't supposed to be. In its zone of comic madness it scores and that by itself is an intelligent feat for I will rake it in for Harion Productions with the opening alone Year 2010 has been a superlative year for Vishal Shekhar with three consecutive hit albums I Hate Love Stories Anjana Anjani and Break Ke Baad they have tried to do something different with TMK the already popular Sheila Ki Jawani rock as far as commercial viability is concerned soundtracks like Sheila Ki Jawani and Tees Mar Khan are the hot favorites and have already created a buzz for the film Bade Dilwala is indeed a surprise package while Valla Re Valla and Happy Ending will be there to follow 
Tismar Khan is crazy, it's cool, it's fast paced and it's a fun watch. Over the year and holidays it will rake it in. It's got a big banner, a big budget, big names and a rocking item number. It has a voiceover by Sanjay Dutt, cameos by Anil Kapoor and Salman Khan and all the ingredients that make for a successful film. Where it falters is in the story which stays in one zone and doesn't try too hard to impress. It's a spoofy film and more gags would have been welcome. Also, the second half could do with a minor edit. T. Smart Khan will close out 2010 with a bang and bring a smile to everyone's faces, but it's not brilliant, as is always expected of Farah Khan in whatever she does. It falls a little short. Still, it works. So watch it and laugh. I give it two and a half stars for Madcap Watch. After a short break, I'll be right back with the reviews of Toon Purka Superhero and The Tourist. So don't go anywhere. <laughs> Welcome back to the Zoom Review Show. I am Omar Qureshi. The second release of the week is Toonpur's superhero. Ajay Devgan makes his way into the cartoon world with his lovely wife Kajol for company. Let's see what these two are going to show. Ajay Devgan plays superstar Aditya Kumar and makes a superb entry on a jet ski, a James Bond style. For the first time in his career, Ajay's co-stars are cartoon characters and he does well to interact with them. He also eats and he gets kissed by them as well. He is funny when required and serious when needed. We have seen a lot of this talented actor in 2010 and as usual he doesn't disappoint. In fact, Ajay gets better and better. For the third time this year, we get to see the brilliant Kajol on the big screen and I can't remember when the last time that happened. Unfortunately though, she doesn't have a meaty role. She plays Ajay's wife and a doting mother who has an obsession with Vastu Shastra. She is a complete natural as always and we hope to see more of her in full-fledged roles rather than fleeting appearances. 3D animation is still at a nascent stage in Bollywood and with this film, the makers have taken a big step combining animation and live action and the result, though not spectacular, is very commendable. The detailing is good, care has been taken to show the shadows of humans and cartoons together and after a while, you tend to forget that you are seeing a fusion of live action and animation which is a compliment to the makers. Multiple award winning animator Kirit Khurana makes his debut as director with Toonpur. This is the first time live action and 3D animation have been combined in an Indian film and the result is good by Indian standards. The cartoon characters are well sketched and a few of them are made to resemble known personalities and it's quite funny. It is not easy to direct a film of such a nature and for a first time effort Kirit does a fine job. Toonpur glorifies Ajay Devgan and his superstar status but also pokes fun at him. Apart from the novelty of being a live action and 3D animation film, it has its funny moments and the music to go with it. The scene where a cartoon character mimics Bollywood personalities is nicely done. The film is fairly engaging though it doesn't have much of a story. It picks up pace towards the last 30 minutes but seems to be inspired from the Hollywood movie Spy Kids. This could be a film kids would like to watch this Christmas so I go with two and a half stars for Toonpur ka superhero. Hollywood biggies Johnny Depp and Angelina Jolie star together for the first time in The Tourist. When two of Hollywood's sexiest stars come together on screen, you expect fireworks, right? Well, not quite. While we do get to admire the beautiful city of Venice, no such luck for Johnny Depp and Angelina Jolie. There is no chemistry between them. That said, in a film of this nature, you need to have some action and tension. But sadly, you have more of a cat and mouse chase than adrenaline pumping action. So perhaps it aims to be a romantic thriller, except that there is hardly any romance. And the twist in the tale becomes more or less predictable. This journey ends rather unpleasantly for the tourists, so I go with two stars. So, friends, I have told you that my verdict is on this new film. After a short break, we will see the audience's verdict on the new movies. Welcome back. I am Omar Qureshi on the Zoom Review Show. Let's see what the audiences have to say from the first day, first shows. Please, damn nice. Sheila Ki Jawar is sexy. Yeah, it was superb. Akshay Kumar rocks. Very fun in movie. Akshay Kumar rocks. Not that good. Boring. Overacting. Fantastic. Good. Excellent. Movie is really good. Akshay is awesome. Very bad. Akshay was good. Must. Ek dum band ba jati sab ki. Paisa awesome. Paisa awesome. Awesome. Good. Very good for students. For for children. Damn good. बहुत अच्छी थी। आज देवगन की एक्टिंग बहुत अच्छी। It's fine for kids. Really good movie. Worth watching. Oh, Ajay was very good. Kajal was good too. Funny. Awesome. I really like the movie. And now a quick recap of my ratings for this week's films. I've given T. Smart Khan two and a half stars. 
टूनपुर का सुपर हीरो टू एंड हाफ स्टार्स एंड द टूरिस्ट को मैंने दिए टू स्टार्स थैंक्स फॉर मैसेजिंग मी योर कॉमेंट्स ऑन द न्यू मूवीज आप मुझे अपने कॉमेंट्स भेजते रहिए फेसबुक डॉट कॉम स्लैश ओमर कुरैशी पर यू कैन ऑल्सो एस एम एस मी एट फाइव डबल एट डबल एट टाइप सेट आर स्पेस द फर्स्ट थ्री लेटर्स ऑफ द फिल्म नेम स्पेस योर नेम स्पेस योर रेटिंग फ्रॉम वन टू फाइव स्पेस योर कॉमेंट्स इफ एनी टू फाइव डबल एट डबल एट वी विल एयर योर कॉमेंट लाइव ड्यूरिंग द शो देर इज समथिंग फॉर एवरी वन दिस हॉलीडे वीकेंड comedy drama action animation so go out enjoy the movies and savor the goodies have fun opening your christmas presents main agle hafte phir lautunga same time same place for the year end special only on the zoom review show so don't miss that one this is omar qureshi of filmy santa claus saying ho 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 and god bless mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm.